The emerging field of bioelectronic medicine provides an exciting new alternative to treat neurological disorders. In this paper, we propose Neural Dust, which uses ultrasound to power and communicate with miniature sensors implanted inside the body. The sensor consists of a piezoelectric transducer for harvesting ultrasonic energy, a custom ASIC for communication, and recording electrodes on the back side of the implant. The implants are encapsulated in a medical grade epoxy to provide insulation. Test leads can be used to measure the voltage across the transducer and the signals from the recording electrodes. Before being implanted in an animal, each fabricated neural dust implant or moat is tested on a benchtop setup. The moat is mounted on the acrylic stage and the transducer and the moat are fully aligned. In order to confirm backscatter communication, artificial neural signatures can be introduced into a water tank and changes in backscatter amplitude should be apparent. The entire in vivo measurement can be done on a tabletop. Adult male long Evans rats are used in all experiments and are anesthetized. The neural dust moat is placed either on the muscle for EMG recording or placed in contact and sutured to the epineurium of the main branch of the sciatic nerve. Once implanted, the wound is sutured closed, leaving the test leads exposed to validate wireless recordings. Commercial ultrasound gel is used to enhance coupling, and the external transducer is aligned to produce the largest return signal at the time delay corresponding to the transducer's focal distance. Once the transducer and the moat are aligned, the test leads are removed to initiate wireless operation. Single biphasic stimulation pulses near the implant site are used to evoke neural activity in the anesthetized preparation. The custom transceiver module launches a series of transmit pulse trains and then waits to receive the backscatter. Received backscatters are amplified, filtered, rectified, and the computed L1 norm produce the reconstructed waveform. The reconstructed waveform is sampled at the frequency of the launched ultrasonic pulse train. Current neural dust measures millimeters on the side, but we are working to deliver a suite of sub-millimeter scale neural dust modes capable of recording chronically from the nervous system.